Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be doing my monthly highlights in my B6. This is the Simply Gilded B6. I am still a little bit poorly, <clears throat> as you can probably hear. Um, so I'm sorry if I cough or sniff during this. Um, if you're new to my channel, I have been doing these monthly highlights in these inserts and I've really been enjoying doing them. I've been really looking forward to filling out for June, no, May, we're in June now. Um, these are my inserts, they're available in my shop and you can, there's like a choice of how many months you want in a pack, but they are on my shop in case you are new or you haven't seen me do these before. I am gonna pull in my sticker book again. This was from um, Amazon and I used it last time. I used the gold, I think I might switch it up and use the black this time, even though I absolutely loved how the gold looked. I'm just going to switch up and do black on this page. So I've got that, I've got my stickers, I've got my pen. So um, last time a couple of you suggested maybe adding a word to describe the day as well as a poppet. So I'm going to try that this month. I've got my poppets pulled out and I've got my list. This is where I just jot down everything that's happened throughout the month. So I know what I'm putting in. And I've already started on obviously June because we're now in June. Today is the, what is today? Second, today's the second of June. Anyway, let's get on with May. So the first thing that I'm gonna do, no, are we in May? March, April, May. My um, cold and flu tablets make me go a bit loopy, obviously. Do these not have the months? Oh, they're right here. Oh God, this is gonna be a long video. Let me make sure that you are also zoomed in before we begin. Um, and possibly in frame would be good. Okay, excellent. So I'm gonna grab May. I know I've just checked 50 times, but we are May, right? Yes. And I'm just gonna cover up the notes header with May. Straight if I can. Okay, and then I'm just going to put in the date. So the first was on a Saturday, I believe. So in this book, there's also these date dots too, super handy. And the first was on a Saturday, so I'm just going to be putting these in. So I hope you're enjoying this amazing weather that we're having. Um, I'm actually enjoying it today, so I've been poorly for a little while, and... The last thing I wanted to do was go out and enjoy some sun while I'm full of cold because that just makes you feel even more rubbish. But I've actually been outside today and it's gorgeous out there and it's made me really happy. Um, so that's another reason why I thought I'd film right now because I've taken tablets. I'm feeling pretty good right now. So it was a good time for me to sit down and film. Plus I'm designing today and a design day is always a great day <laughs> just because I like doing it so much. Um, but yeah, I'm not sure how long the warm weather is supposed to last for. I know it's definitely this week, but then I'm not sure after that. Oh, there we go. But hopefully the weather's nice wherever you are. And hopefully it continues, because my goodness, was, um, was it a lot of rain lately? So much rain every single day. <laughs> Um, what else do I have to tell you? It's not really much. I did miss um, a new release last weekend just because I've been, you know, really busy, but I've also been really poorly and I just did not get the chance to um, put anything out for me to release. So I'm really sorry that I missed that. But I've got some nice releases coming out for you in the coming weeks, which is exciting. This one won't come up. There we go. Hard to grab it. Um, this month we've had a couple of birthdays for um, May. Um, my mum retired, which is so weird that she's now at home. It's a bit bizarre, but um, yeah, so that happened. So May's been quite an eventful month, really. And I've just done a lot of working. I think that's why I've been a bit poorly for a long time, just because I've worked so much and I haven't given myself a break or anything. And obviously that's not good for you. Plus when I've been working at the weekends and things, I 
rarely stop for lunch or anything. So I was basically living on chocolate, crisps, energy drinks. So that also isn't very good for you, is it? Uh, how many days? 31, isn't there? But I've been really excited to film this because I enjoyed it last month so much. And I was really pleased that you guys seemed to enjoy it as well. So that meant that I could do it again. I kind of like the black. I'm going to have to invest in some more date dots. Maybe I can get some silver ones or some hollow ones would be nice. The only thing is that I probably won't be able to get the little uh, monthly sticker, but that'll be okay. We can figure something else out. 25, 26, 27... I've also still yet to use my um, hub and, no, what have I got? What planner is that over there? Oh, it's this planner here, the Stalogy. I don't know what I was trying to say. Um, I haven't used it yet. It's still completely blank. I don't know what to use it for. I just bought it. <laughs> but um, I've got lots of planners sitting up there that I haven't used yet and I need to um, start using them. I think I just got really busy and then didn't have time. So I've got like a memory one that I've really wanted to do a spread in and um, I just haven't had time to do it. I also didn't put up a um, tiny video again this week. That's because that's a silent planning. Oh, I've really got, oh, right. Um, a silent planning, what am I saying, video. And um, I can't go two minutes without sniffing. So I didn't film one yesterday. So there won't be one of those going up this week again. So that'll be the second one I've missed. But you know, sometimes we have to miss them, I guess. Okay, so that's all of the date dots down and everything. So we'll just go in day by day. So on Saturday the 1st, we went to pick up paint for my daughter's room. Um, still haven't painted it. The paint is still sitting there. <laughs> Uh, but we did go and pick that up, so we went to B and Q. So I'll just write B and Q, I guess. B and Q. I'm using the Paper Mate Flare in medium. It's been my go-to pen lately. I'm really enjoying how black it is and how easy it is to write with because it's like a felt tip pen. Completely out of shot, sorry. And then on the second, it was my dad's birthday. I'll just leave a lid off of that. I'm not doing very good at this. Perhaps I've zoomed you in too much, maybe. And that's why. I'm zooming out a little bit. Oh, I can't click it. There you go. Um, dad. Birthday. And then for the third what's happening on the third oh my god it turned so cold we had a really long cold spat so i'm going to use one of my poppet scarves and i've got to write so cold so cold it felt like winter honestly um so i'm really glad to see the sunshine and then on the fourth it was my mum's birthday kind of handy that they're both together. Sorry, my cat's jumping up on my desk. Um, I'll put him in the, in the middle-ish. That's fine. And I will just write mum birthday. Mum birthday. Yeah, it's super handy that they're both close together because then you'll never forget when their birthdays are. <laughs> Or you can do like a joint birthday thing. Um, and then on the 5th, oh, on the 5th, um, somebody decided to reverse into my car and completely write it off. So that was fun. Luckily, nobody was hurt. And, you know, my children weren't in the car or anything. But that was a, a bad day. So if I write car, I don't write accident because that sounds horrendous. Um, car write off, shall I write? Write off. That was not a fun time. Car write off. 
My hands are still a bit shaky, so my writing isn't going to be the best. My writing was atrocious in my plan with me I'd done um, last week too. Um, and then on the 6th, oh, I've done a lot of filming on the 6th. Got everything. I'm not going to be able to fit any writing on there. Um, I got all of my videos filmed in one day. So film. And then on the 7th, oh, we had our hire car. Um, delivered while well, we obviously didn't have a car until we bought another one and the hire car was amazing because it was less than a year old and it was just it was a gorgeous car so um i was so pleased to drive that car i'll put in hire car even the kids like the car kind of sad when i had to give it back <laughs> and then on the 8th um i done a massive clean inside the house just went off for one. Wasn't planning to, but it just kind of happened. It was kind of like a spring clean. So I write spring. Um, is that going to fit? We'll make it fit. Spring clean. Maybe I should have waited until next month to write. Never mind. We've already started now. So, and then on the ninth, what happened on the ninth? Zoom in a little bit. There we go. Um, on the ninth, oh, we put some shelves up in my son's room. So he's got a lot of collectibles and we put the shelf up for him to fill up. Even though we put four up, they're all full. <laughs> uh, so I have to get some more uh, shelves. Up. And then moving over to the tenth. Oh, on the 10th I got caught in the rain at work and once you get wet you obviously stay wet all day so I was not in the best of moods because I was freezing cold and I was wet um, so I'll just write caught in the rain caught in the rain That's one way to make me grumpy, is um, to keep me cold. <laughs> and then on the 11th, oh, I worked on the inserts. That was the day that I worked on them. So if you are new to my channel, I've got monthly inserts. And then I've also got some, we I've just dropped my sticker, weekly inserts as well, which are all in my shop. And on the 11th is when I sat down and designed them all. And that was the first time I've done anything like that, so it was quite exciting. Um, I am going to be bringing some more sizes, so currently I just have B6 size, because obviously I use a B6 planner, but I'm thinking I might bring A6 or A5 to the shop soon. Um, let me know down below what size you think I should bring to my shop. Um, for the 12th, I worked on orders all day, had quite a lot of orders to do, so... Got them done on there. So I'll just write orders. And I would have posted them on that day, right? Normally I post on a Wednesday. Um, what happened on the 13th? Oh, 13th, I worked on the... <coughs> Sorry, I worked on the poppet stamps, um, which were really cute. And again, there's nothing I've done like that before, so... That was um, really nice to work on. Pop it. Stamps. They're just like a little bit of fun. And then on the 14th, I went to work. Where's my tweezers gone? Um, and then normally I do like a coffee run when I go to work. So I'll stick the little coffee thing down here. Or the Costa Pop it. And just write work. And then on Saturday the 15th, oh, on Saturday the 15th, I worked for 11 hours straight. So um, we're going to use that puppet. <laughs> um, I'll write work 11 hours straight. I didn't even stop for like a lunch or anything 
just worked 11 hours. I think this is the day where it all started to go downhill and I didn't feel the greatest. Well, I don't think anybody would feel the greatest after doing that many hours, but I think that's where I started not feeling well. Um, on the 16th, um, I started planning my mum's retirement little party thing. So I'm just going to write... Um, I write retirement. Oh god, I'm gonna start sniffing now. I'm so sorry. Retirement plans. Feel free to mute the video if you don't want to hear me sniff. <laughs> um, on the seventeenth. Oh, on the seventeenth, I was a manager for the day, and I managed my whole team, and it was stressful to say the least. So. Um, all right, manager, manager day. And I just found that very stressful to manage the whole team. I work at Centre Parks, by the way, in case you didn't know. I'm just gonna um, sort myself out and I'll be right back. Okay, for the 18th, um, I've done orders again. So I'll pop him in down in the corner maybe. Oh, I've stuck him now. He's there now. <laughs> I'll just write orders. I guess I've done a lot of orders again because um, I wouldn't write, I do orders every week. So unless I've done like a lot of orders, I won't write it in my monthly highlights because then it would literally all be orders. <laughs> so I must have done a lot of orders on the 18th. And then on the 19th, I finished watching The Crown on Netflix. And I was really sad because I really enjoyed watching it. Um, I'm hoping they're going to make another season. Maybe. It'd be nice if they did. Um, Alright, finished. Finished The Crown. So if nobody has seen that, I would definitely recommend it. I watched it all the time, literally every day. And then on the 20th, oh, I had a little order freak out. <laughs> I had um, a lot of orders and it was like um, overnight I had a lot of orders. It didn't gradually build up as like it normally does. And I just had a little freak out. But that's okay. You can freak out if you run a shop. That's absolutely fine. So I write order. I think I was running low on envelopes as well. So that just added to it. Order freak out. I've put double E instead of an A. Oh well. Oh well. Just don't look at it. On the 21st, um, oh, I went and worked with my sister. So I took the day off of my work to go and work with my sister. Um, so I've put one of the little angry puppets in there. And I will write work. With Joe. And then for the 22nd. Oh, the 22nd is when we went out and bought a car. Um, so we had to give the hire car back and oh. Spent a little bit more than what I was expecting on a car. So I've got um, this puppet here. I haven't been telling you where any of these puppets are from. I'm so sorry. The This one here is, it's got like a little bill and a shocked face. And it's from the home life sheet. But I'm going to use that to mark paying for a car because my bank was suddenly £7,000 lighter than it was a few hours beforehand. So um, that's why I'll use that face. <laughs> Bought, cars are just so expensive right now. Bought new car. Well, it's not brand new, but it's new to us. <laughs> and then on the 23rd, what happened on the 23rd? Oh, 23rd, I worked for 10 hours straight. See, I do it to myself. Um, so I've put this pop it down from the feeding sheet. So on a Saturday and Sunday, I normally work with my sister. She has a tent company. And when she does the big bell tents, 
I'll see if I can put some pictures here so you guys know what I'm talking about. But when she does the bell tents, then I go and help her because obviously it takes more than one person to do. Um, so yeah, I work through the week and then weekends I work with my sister. Um, I'll just write tent job. And it took us 10 hours. And then moving over to the 24th, so this is the last week. So on the 24th, it was my nephew's birthday. He was three. I'm going to put this little couple's poppet down because we went over and said happy birthday. He's so adorable and so cute. Um, all right, Charlie birthday. I'm not going to fit this in here. I'll squeeze it. Charlie B day. And then on the 25th, this is where I really started to feel really poorly. But on the 25th, oh, so the car, the car that we just bought on the Saturday, um, we went out and then I realised that the brake lights went back and my partner drove the car and I was standing behind it and I realised when he was braking or when he put his foot on the brake, there was no brake lights. Um, so we were not impressed at all. And that was probably the most scariest drive because... You can easily have an accident if your brake lights aren't working. So um, that was not a good day. <laughs> brake. Lights. Not working. I realised I was supposed to be putting um, one word to describe the day. And I've written several words on several boxes, but... Never mind. <laughs> and then on the 26th, 26th I had like a mini breakdown. Um, I just, yeah, just had a breakdown. Um, well, there's nothing for me to say about that. <laughs> so I've used one of these poppets from the Worried Sheet. I think it was just a mix of everything. I wasn't feeling well. I just spent a lot of money on a car. The brake lights weren't working and I wasn't feeling well. So I had a, a meltdown. But I allowed myself to have the meltdown, and then in a few hours you move on. As long as you don't dwell on it, then um, you're fine. So that day was a waste. <laughs> and then on the 27th, on the 27th, I done orders, and because I had a meltdown on the Wednesday, I had to finish the orders on Thursday, but I stayed up till two in the morning to do that. So I'll do um, late, late night. I'll just write late night. Because I wanted to make sure that everyone's orders still went out on time. So just stayed up for that. And then on the 28th, oh, it was when my mum retired. I don't really have any retirement or anything to do with that poppet. So I've just put the love heart ones because she's worked hard all of her life. So... I was really pleased to see that she can retire and start enjoying everything. So I'll write mum. And this is the night that we went over as well, me and my sister. Rum, rum, <laughs> mum, retirement. I've forgotten how to spell retirement then. Um, for the 29th, um, I've written down here, these were my worst two days really. So I'm just going to put the poorly poppets down. These are both from the poorly sheet. Really did not feel too good at all. Well, I'm still not well, but um, I'm just going to write poorly. I'm going to write poorly there. And then for the 31st, it was bank holiday. So I'm going to put a little smiley face down. I still had to go off to work, but everybody else seemed to enjoy their bank holiday at home so I'm just going to put a little happy pop it down and write bank holiday bank holiday I feel like I've messed this spread up by writing I don't know you have to let me know what you think let me zoom you out oh, I didn't bring anything to fill in this section here maybe I'll pick something well, this isn't the month to pick a good highlight because I don't think anything amazing happened. Uh, no, what I'll do is I'll go and find some washi because that's what I done last time, isn't it? 
yeah, I put some washi down there. So I'll go and see what I can find to put there. Okay, so I've got the washi that I bought when I bought this sticker book. This is from the same company on Amazon. I do keep checking, but this has been out of stock for a long time and it's still not in stock. I think their washi tapes are. There was another one here. Um, so I was going, oh, the B one. I was going to use some of that, but then I thought I might actually use my stamps because I designed my stamps on this month. And I can stick a load of stamps going down here. Do we think? Do we like that idea? So these, if you haven't seen them, they're just a stamp set. They've got some poppets in and then some other ones. And you just rip it up. Are you in focus before I start? Yes. Um, you just you rip it off and it's like a little stamp. And then you can just pull out for the next one. Let me just see what ones I want to use quick. I'm just going to pull them all out. Because um, there's some like patterned ones here. Um, I kind of like the colours of this one. Actually, I could just, let me pull them all out. There we go. Um, what ones do I want to use? Shall I do the positive ones? Because we've got a lot of poppets here, so I could just do these ones that don't have any poppets on them. Rather than put more poppets in, might be poppet overload. I might just do that, I think. So it'll be up to this one. So if I turn that one off. I'm going to have to cut around that because it just covers those. But let me, um, I might even be able to stick this down in one giant sticker rather than do it separately. I don't know if that'll work. Where's my tweezers? <laughs> I'm holding my breath. <laughs> oh, it does. Perfect, Dave. Okay. So if I stick this one. Let me see. If I stick this, stip, stick this one in the middle at the top. Go down. Like that. Um, how far do I want to come down with that one? Is it going to look weird if I chop the end off though? Let me grab my scissors. Oh. Just grab my scissors. And I guess oh. just gonna cut straight along. I don't think that was straight. Oh my goodness. Okay. It's fine. Maybe I'll match it up then. There we go. That kind of looks okay. <laughs> right, let me zoom you guys out. Um, this one. I swear, my brain's just not with it. Okay, so that is how... Oh, they're quite like them. I'm glad I used them and not washy. So that's how this month has turned out. My monthly highlights for May. Um, did I do anything else? No. Definitely more full with me writing in it though. I can definitely see... So that was a good suggestion. So thank you for everybody for watching my video. If you are new to my channel, then make sure you hit subscribe because I put up new videos every week. Sometimes I put multiple up. I haven't done for the last two weeks, but I haven't been well. But I will get back into uploading more videos next week. And wherever you are, I hope you have an amazing day and I'll speak to you next time. Bye guys.